Our star is full of wonder. The creation of stars fascinates my mind. Star formations and great pillars and distant nebulae captivate my imagination like a child seeing the moon for the first time. The crescent moon illuminates the southwestern sky tonight, creating a view that is majestic and wonderful. These weights resemble the hardships of astrophotography. These cords, while mangled and beaten, provide life to my Frankenstein's monster. It bears the burden while keeping the stars still. Fusion from a star form the elements which are my telescope today. Tonight's challenge is reinstalling all AP software after my imaging laptop failed, but I will succeed. Night one begins. Seemingly the heavens open and reveal their secrets for those who care to view. The road we travel is often deranged by the idea of perfection and drives us to image for hours until we gather enough light to make a picture worth more than a thousand words. Another clear night is here and more distant light is to be collected. The sunlight grazes off the clouds, pointing to the sky. I start as I always start, looking up to the pole star. Being out amongst the stars can begin to feel sacred as I leave my thoughts behind. Great pillars collapse into young stars, a cosmic dance orchestrated by the curvature of space-time. This is NGC 7822, a nameless nebula in Cepheus, 2,900 light years away. Star formations and great pillars and distant nebulae captivate my imagination like a child seeing the moon for the first time.
tear down, but my mind will stay wandering out in the cosmos. 